Oh, hey, hello. Sorry, I didn't notice you watching me. What am I doing? Oh, you know, just having a game of cards with myself. Huffing down a fat Cuban stogie. Sucking down a fat long neck. Then chilling with my massive banana. And as we all know, behind every serious drinking problem is an even more serious bald cave. <laughs> So here we are back down in Freelancer HQ getting ready to smash out the fourth leg of this assignment. And to think we've already gone through one, two, three before this. Anyway, let's get some more clothes. Ah, uh, yes, this should do nicely. And for today, I'm going to go with Arms Trafficker because it sends us to Ambrose, Colorado, Hokkaido, Isle of Scale, Paris, and Whittleton Creek. And because Colorado is basically the Hitman level equivalent of ball cancer, let's get this out of the way first, shall we? Hmm, okay. Ice Pick Kill, Katana Kill, Silent Ascent. Well, that's definitely not going to work. <laughs> so I'm limited to these two. All right, I guess Ice Pick Kill it is. And here we are. Beautiful Cholera Dildo. The happiest place on earth. I mean, just look at that color palette. Anyway, looking around, we've got one target directly in front of us and another one all the way over there. I have a feeling that this is going to be an easy one, boyos. But first, I'm going to have to do something about this chap. Ah, he's turned around. Perfect. Look, it's amazing. You turn it on, and hay comes out the other end. Let me just sneak past these delightful gentlemen and head over to the weapons dealer and see what this guy's packing today. I'm sure it's something tasty. Oh my goodness, that guy <laughs> that guy's taking a massive piss. What the, that's gross, bro. Oh, you're kidding. You're too, you're too busy to sell me something. You're just out there sucking down a durry. Yes. I don't, I don't know. I'll just take this. Thanks, mate. Hey, you. Show me those... Oh, dear. That's not good. All right, let me just put down a little trap. And, mate, you're going to need to just shut up and stay down, you twit. Oh, sorry. He's still talking. <laughs> He's still talking even after his neck got snapped. That's dedication. By the way, mate, this is all your fault. But it's fine. Everything's fine. Look at that. Look at it. Clean shot. Clean. No, stop walking. Oh, you idiot. You stupid idiot. All right, that's fine. We'll get you. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Oh, crap. That was not the best shot in the world. Oh my gosh, I am a useless human being. That's fine. All right, here we go. This is this is where things start to get all hectic. Um, where's the bloody? Oh shite! It's fine. Everything's fine. We're nearly there. So smooth. Tactical testicle. Stealth assassin. Flexible murderer. Fair enough. How about this time we go create a little more chaos in Paris, France? And let's go with the epic sniper kill. Where is it? Where is it? The hackle. Here we go. The hackle dackle sniper rifle cackle. And here we are starting in the attic with our sniper rifle in our briefcase ready to cause some misery. Pain and misery. This one's for you. This one's for you. All right. Taken care of. Smooth. <laughs> Would you look at that? One of our targets is right here. That's gangbusters. So let's find a good position to deal with this guy. He's sitting on the pecuta. There we go. Nobody will even notice. Let's just zoom in. Spang. Nobody knows nothing because it's got a silencer. Now I think we might do the old double wacko combo again and take down these two guys. So there's one thing over your head and there's another thing over your head. Oh, you idiot. You stupid idiot. You dumb idiot. Now everyone's going to have to die. This is very unfortunate. It didn't need to be like this. Oh, look at this guy. He's just walking right up here. Well, that's handy. Let me just, you know. Now I'll just wait here in this dusty room until everybody forgets what happened. Later in the void. Man, I've arrived at the location and it looks clear. Over. Okay, well, fair enough then. Ah, but hold on, hold on. There we go. All right, there's one of our targets. It's the, the techie guy. You know the techie guy? He was a great techie guy, that guy. All right, so... <laughs> For some reason, um, you know, everybody's searching for me. I, I don't, I don't even know what they don't even know who they're searching for. They're just all running up into the attic and getting domed. And because all the guards are dead, I can walk down the stairs without anybody getting in my way. And here we are. All right, let's get this done. Oh, it's all right. I got a good feeling about this. It's gonna go through this door. Watch. Now let me try. One, two, three, four, half, oh, five, and just like that. Escape has been achieved. Impressive work you did back there. Yes, I know, Diana. It's now time to do it all over again at Ambrose Island. This guy knows that I'm sus. Sorry, mate, but it's a prerequisite. Oh, what? How is there a, a guard right here? Sorry, folks, there'll be no running away today. You're just gonna have to sleep. Everyone sleep. Oh, that, <laughs> that was one of the targets. <laughs> what? You know, they say splashing some water on the face of an unconscious person wakes them up. So let's just splash this guy. Oh. 
Oh, he died. <laughs> His face isn't even in the water, though. You see, this guy I would understand, but this guy, not so much. Now, the uh, complication for this mission is a legendary headshot. So, you know, this will be legendary. There we go. All right, done. You know, this is, this is going to be a doozy for the local detective to figure out. <laughs> So let's keep on moving to our next target, of which apparently there's only one. This is going to be an easy one. I really shouldn't whack this guy in the head, but you know, it's all part of it. And I think he might, yeah, there we go, he's inside of the secret lair. Now, what I really like is that I'm not even trying, oh yeah, see, that's, it's hostile. It's hostile over this line in the sand. Yeah. <laughs> There's not, you know what I'm talking about? I don't know. It's like, this is the invisible line. Right there is where things get hostile. Everything on this side of the sand is fine. But once you step over here, mate, you mess up your f So let's crack out the old banga banga boom boom. We're going to take down these two. All right, there's one, two, and the camera. Three, all right, beauty. Oh, he's behind a wall, that cheeky bastard. Oh, and there he goes past the opening. All right, that's the opening where I gotta get it. Here we go, wait for it, wait for it, wait for it, come on. Yeah, boy, that's it, done, done, and done. Let's stuff this in the case and piss off out of here. Oh, but before I forget, hello, double agent, you got some guns for me? You name it, I got it. Oh, yeah, you got any, um, you know, crack cocaine off? Now, I'm gonna need to run around with the sniper rifle in my hand and another one on my back, because I'm an idiot, so let's do that. And, um, get this party over and done with. See you later, Ambrose Island. <laughs> Boat noises. Oh, only three levels left. Oh, I can't believe it. This was just way too quick and easy. And I think I'll go with collateral kills firearms. Um, and I'll just, again, use a sniper rifle. Like the good old hackle dackle cackle. And find a way to line up my targets with uh, some other unfortunate person. You know... <laughs> I don't know why they've put me in this abandoned bloodstained house with like literally nobody else. <laughs> what the hell? I don't know what happened here, mate. Oh, hey, what the hell? There's a dude in here. <laughs> There's just one dude. What are you doing, one dude? Oh, he's the plumber. He's fixing the stuff. All right, well, you know, I'll fix you. No! Yes! Now, I think, yeah, I might be able to reach that guy now. Let me just crack out the old doodah. See, we'll zoom in a little bit. All right, where is he? All right, there he is. But he looks like he's behind. Oh, he's that guy on the um stuff. That actually makes all of this so much easier. Or maybe... I could do it from a cubby house, a tree house. Yeah, that would be even more classic. Oh, this is this is dope, mate. This is like a this is professional right here. Tree house kill. <laughs> oh, here we go. Boom! That's what I'm talking about. Ha <laughs> ha. Now let's just lob that over the fence and then jump the fence so that we're not trespassing. Nothing to see here, everybody. That's my briefcase. Piss off. Then we'll be casually making our way downtown, walking fast, faces pass, and I'm homebound. Da -da 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 -da. And would you look at that inside of Janus the Anus's garage, there's an arms dealer. Typical. There is nothing strange about the garage door opening thingy being on the outside of the house. All right, mate, give me your goods. What do you got? I only sell good merch. All right, give me good merch. Let's go. Anyway, back over the fence we go. Then for a little bit of cheeky banger banger boom boom, this is for you and this is yours. Oh shoot, how did they even see that? That's so silly. It's fine, everything's fine. I'll just disappear into this person's basement. Oh hey, look at this, this is stylish. <laughs> Oh, gosh. Don't get me started on my drum solo. You know, funnily enough, our target's right there next door in Janus the Anus's basement. And actually, speaking of which, that's his private bodyguard. Maybe if I throw him a duck, I can get him to deliver the duck to Janus, and then, you know, I can blow him up with it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, 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 look. Oh, <laughs> I sucked in Janus. We're gonna blast that anus. In the meantime, I think I might see what's on the other side of this very suspicious door. What do we got in here, eh? We got books. Ah, uh, pull book. All right, let's pull book. What does this do? This da. Oh, what the hell? Wow. Hello. What's this room? All right, we got some clothes over here. What do we got? Okay, anus, a bodyguard, and a gun. We've also got garbage man attire. And what looks like a secret underground door that connects directly to our our target. Oh, nicey, nicey, spicy, ricey. And now all that's left to do is to get stealthy up in the his house. And then this is the target. Here we go. Hold on. Let's just smash him with some heads. This is yours. Oh, sorry. The wrong one. Sorry. This is yours. Oh, no, that wasn't it either. Was it maybe this? No. Okay. Maybe it's um this one. Nope. Okay. Well, that's my bad. Sorry. Maybe this one. Is this, is this it? 
Yeah, that's the one. Now to very stealthily hang this guy up in the wardrobe. Destroy the evidence. Bleep, 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 bleep. Da, 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 da. I like to see that they're maintaining <laughs> their computer system. Anyway, let's hop over the fence and join the party like a normal person. Nothing sus. And then as soon as Janus heads out on the patio to get a little bit of fresh air, we do some boom, boom, banga, banga, boom, boom. Oh, speak of the devil. <laughs> Beautiful. See you later, Whittleton Creek. All right, all right, all right. It looks like we've got Isle of Scale and we've got Hokkaido. Let's go with Hokkaido. And none of these um, are any good. These are all absolute sh I mean, I can't really see myself taking a baseball bat on this mission and whacking someone in the head with it without getting spotted. But that's fine. We'll give it a crack anyway. And just in case, I'll also bring a nice silence pistol. I'll go with... Uh, oh, I don't know what I'll go with. What will I... I'll go with the... Um, um, the ICA DTF Stealth. And here we are, beautiful Hokkaido, Japan, seemingly in the morgue. Oh, <laughs> okay, so this is how it is. All right, it looks like everyone's leaving. This is the perfect opportunity for me to hop up off of the bed and disappear before anybody notices that I'm not actually dead. Now, I reckon my first order of business is to not be trespassing anymore, at least momentarily. So let's head into the canteen. What are the chances we get through here without getting spotted, eh? We're only going to get past like eight people or something. And a camera. Yeah, that's that's not working. Ah, but we can head through here. Then we take the baseball bat out of our briefcase. Don't ask how it fits. And we get ready for some good old-fashioned boom, boom, banger, banger, boom, boom. Look at that. So stealthy. Now to just hide these guys so that nobody ever finds them. And to head inside where finally we are a normal person. <laughs> yeah, right. All right, here we go. Another target heading downstairs. Maybe we can isolate this guy for the old baseball bat in the back of the head trick, eh? Yeah, all we need to do is open this door, make a little bit of noise. Come on, drop the thing out. All right, there we go. He heard that. Now we should come to investigate and then I'll get him. Maybe it was just a poltergeist. Nope, it me. No, no, oh, no. Excellent work, 47. Hello, handsome. <laughs> what the hell? That is not very professional. <laughs> All right, here we go. Old mate's coming down this way. We'll get another one. Are you all right? Yeah, he's fine. Get in here and shut up. Six months later. All right, so things may have got a little bit out of control, but it's fine. Everything's fine. Anyway, let's confiscate all of these illegal weapons that these cretins have brought into this hospital. Then we'll pick up our brief. Oh, nearly forgot. That was a lot of bullets <laughs> in the penis to take that guy down. He's a real man. Anyway, we got one target over here. I know how to deal with this one. This is for you, Mr. Champion Man. There you go. All right, let me just detonate that off. Oh, me. Did I even get it? I didn't get him, did I? So obviously my rubber ducky explosion didn't go according to plan. Actually, I take that back. Hold on. Syndicate member. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There he goes. See you later, sucker. Oh, wait. Hold on. You know what I just remembered? We still haven't got the safe yet. And it looks like it's where we started. Down in the morgue. Much later. There. Now that we're in, the safe should be just around the corner. <laughs> what is this? What a disaster. Oh, my goodness. Is this every guard in Hokkaido? I had nothing to do with any of this. It is the morgue, though. So, you know, it's not as weird as it looks. Anyway, here's the safe. Let's pop it open and see what we've got. Da -da, um, a $2 coin. Anyway, let's head up to the little lookout where the ninja likes to hang out because I am a ninja. Then I feel like this will be the perfect place to get the job done. All right. Well, maybe, maybe not. Probably not. No, actually, you know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe I can do this, baby. Look at this. Look at this. One, two, three. Boom. I am so great. I am so great. G-R-A-T-E. And yes, this cliff leads to nowhere. <laughs> I didn't think that through very well. And just like that, we are now up to the final leg of this three-legged donkey. Isle of Scale. Ooh, baby. I've provided you with new intel. I don't care. Please shut your mouth. It smells like Taco Bell. All right, so for the final mission, what am I going to take with me? I think I'm going to take the good old, you know, the silver... No, I haven't taken this one yet. I'll take the old short baller. That's what I often get called because I'm actually two foot two. All right, unsilenced pistol kill. No, lame. Assault rifle, neutralizer, assault rifle. Which means that I'm going to need to find something very, very spicy that has a silencer on it. Not really many choices. The makeshift scrap assault 
assault rifle. This looks like us. And here we are climbing out of the ocean in a hoodie. Completely not sus. Nope, I don't have a boat. I literally did climb out of the water. It's fine. Everything's fine. Now we've gathered some clues as to who we're looking for. We know that they're a handover meeting. They're an earring. They're a glasses. They're a gray hair. They're a necklace. They're a dehydration. They're a sweet tooth. They should be easy to find. All right, you got red hair. It's not you. You got gray hair. Could be you. Oh, but this guy doesn't have glasses. Nope, not him. All right, hold on. No, okay. Hey, it's lady me. <laughs> <laughs> You're looking great. So the remaining potential targets are all up here somewhere. Hey, guys. Hey, yo, and you waiting for me? I know I'll look great on the purple carpet. Purple and yellow LA Lakers. Get it up, yeah. All right, hold up, hold up. Oh, hold on. Oh, it's, it's this guy. It's definitely this guy. He's, de he's this, this guy. Now, if we want to make this work, I feel like slipping around here, dropping the old briefcase, taking the old gun, climbing up this pipe is the perfect way to do it. I'll try and get up here without anyone spotting me. Just make sure that I'm extra tactically testicle before doing doing so and all right that went well and all i need to do is climb to the top of here and i've got the perfect shot many months later all right there he goes there he goes all right let's get into the perfect position get a nice clean shot from over here i can tell you that leader eliminated boo boo that's how we do it out here in the streets and i'm so stealthy that i did it all with oh this guy could spot me don't look this way champ let me just stuff it in me case and then very casually i run down the steps head down this way to the boat not my boat but that doesn't matter then just like that, campaign completed. Ba boy Impressive, 47. Oh, I know. You have single-handedly managed no, to No, I did it with two hands. I did I no, look. Come on, let's let's just be You're honest. Yeah, I didn't do it with one hand. Alright, I need to. Then as promised, well. Here we go. <clears throat> It's the freelancer beat. Everybody moving their feet. I go out in the street. I look at my phone to find my bank deets. I don't got them. So I can't get Taco Bell. Man, this is hell. I don't know what's wrong, but I smell. I open my mouth and the fumes come out. I walk in a room and the brooms come out. Am I really that stanky? Or maybe they're cranky. Cranky that Hitman so perfect and their game so janky. Matter of fact, you fools looking kind of wanky. You ever been to the gym? You're looking too lanky. Oh, you crying now here. Have my hanky. This is the last episode in this three-piece trilogy. There were moments where we laughed, but moments where it was like a thriller, G. No matter where we went, chaos ensued. People screamed and ran with their mouths open like they were looking for some food. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Soon I'll stick all three parts together and then I'll embroider it. I'll retitle it to the movie and I'll re-upload it. Uh, yeah, that was a burp. I'm feeling kind of bloated.